are these two? They're just a driver and blade. Where's the strength coming from? Well, he is the paragon of Torna. Ah, I've had enough. What? No. There's no need for you to... Ah. <laughs> Incredible! You! Both of you! Huh? That last attack? The force behind it was absurd. I'm amazed! Oh, uh, really? Well, that's just... <laughs> oh, and passing the weapon. What a concept! How did you ever come up with that idea? Oh, well... We were broke. Huh? We couldn't afford meals, let alone another sword. And so we made do. <laughs> You're kidding. <laughs> oh, man, you guys are the best. I haven't laughed this hard in ages. Huh? I really, really like you two. Um... Master Adam! Sir! Milton! Oh, thank goodness you're all right. Master Adam, are you hurt at all? Master Adam? You can't be THE Adam Origo. The Lord of Aletta. Fourth in line to the throne of Torna. Oh, come on, Milton. I've been with him the whole time. You really think these two would cause any harm? You've been using your dumb artifice again, haven't you? Dumb? So, yeah, sure, nothing to worry about, right? <gasps> Milton? Who's this then? Ah, this is Hayes. She rescued me from the jaws of some nasty monsters. I'd better give her my thanks. Hayes. Oh, was she with you? I'm sorry to keep you waiting, my lady. I see. So that's when... What a sad, sad tale, Nora. <laughs> go again. Don't let it get cold now. So then, how come you've enlisted with a band of mercenaries? I guess I like the freedom. This way I'm not tied down. So I can help out. With causes I really believe in, you know? Going's tough everywhere you look these days, right? I can't ignore it, can I? I understand. A fat load of good that'll do. In the long run. The world keeps turning anyway. You might think that. But mercenaries and statesmen each have their own views and ways to affect change. It's not in vain. <laughs> A blade siding with humans. You don't see that every day. I think it's blades like you that are rare. Well, duh. You do know what I am, right? Lacking in compassion. Huh? 
blades like you really are a rare sight. That may be for the best. <sighs> so, about Jin. I suppose you have to take him away from me. I could try to slay you right here. But? But my mission is to stop the Aegis's destruction. To subdue Malos, not to seek out lost trinkets. Who cares about paragons anyway? Huh? How about you two join up? Lend us your strength. You're incredibly powerful. There's loads I want to pick up from you, like that trick from before. Let's see. We'll say I found the Paragon on my journey and decided to entrust him to you. To help with Malos. Well, sound plausible? That's just... speak to me like that he thinks he knows me of course is the word yeah he is I meant you me he you meant you're unpolished after you return to your core you lose your memories however as you gain experience with people gradually the nature of a blade Rather, their feelings. They change and grow. You become more and more human. But you purposely keep yourself apart. Oh, so now it's my fault? No, not at all. I respect that part of you. Um. <laughs> Hey, are you angry about this whole Malos thing? I'm not. Whatever happens, I'll protect you. Be sure of it. We cannot simply ignore what's happening in the world. But... But what? Please say you'll be careful. <laughs> I will. Um, Your Highness? Just Adam is fine. What is it? The going after Malos thing. Could it wait a few days? Oh, is there something you need to do first? I... well, yes. You see, Lady Laura seeks the whereabouts of her mother. Unfortunately, she has her mercenary duties to perform. Therefore, I often go out and conduct these searches myself. I see. Then, you found her? Yes. With all that happened yesterday, I did not have the opportunity to say... My lady, your mother is currently residing in a small hamlet called Torigoth. Torigoth. That's on the edge of Gormot. Ardanian and Sian forces clash out there frequently. It's very dangerous. Indeed. Right. No time to waste. Let us head out there. What? But what about your mission? 
You don't want to see your mother? Uh, of course, but... Then let's go. Malos hasn't hit that part of the world yet. It's as good a place as any to look. You're hoping we might find him there? Exactly. That sounds too easy. We go to the village of Torogoth to find Malos, and you go to Torogoth to find your mother. Everybody wins. And once I found my mother, I join up with you? Hmm, that's the general idea. I'll send my people to notify your mercenary friends. And perhaps we could find a place for your mother in the capital. It should be safe there. Is this normal princely behavior? Ugh, you think this is bad? Just stick around for a bit. Nobody's, like, making you come along, you know? Well, unfortunately, a driver and blade are one in body and soul. As if you don't do whatever you feel like anyway. I know this is all very sudden. Still, we don't know where we'll run into Malos next. It makes sense to stick together, as much as we can. Isn't that... No mistake in it. That's the blade. And that little brat, too. Yeah, the whole village was wiped out. Found myself some great cool crystals, eh? Hey? And I found something else too, something real interesting. Take care of this, okay? I'll be in touch. Ha! Mate's a funny thing. Never thought I'd get to take back that paragon. What I stole in the first place. <laughs> 